I'm Rene Ritchie, and this is the Ought Tens of Apple in just 10 minutes. And we call it the iPad. <laughs> iPad is powered by our own custom silicon. It seems that an Apple employee accidentally left a prototype of the new iPhone at a bar in California last month. Hey, I'm Jason Chen. This is the new iPhone. Oh. Stop me if you've already seen this. Hey, Johnny. There's an awful lot of hoopla, hoopla, around the iPhone antenna. Okay, great. Let's give everybody a case. So what are we going to do? Let's make the best of both. The new iPod Shuffle. It's even smaller than the second generation. The new iPod Nano has multi-touch. And it's really small. We're announcing something really cool, and we call it Ping. I have one here, actually. I mean, look at this. That's it. It's this little tiny box. What is the philosophy behind Mac OS X Lion? Well, that's where Back to the Mac comes from. It's one of the most amazing things we've ever created. It is our new MacBook Air, and we think it's the future of notebooks. All of Apple is very, very excited to bring the iPhone to Verizon's 93 million customers. <laughs> so I get to talk about iCloud. It's a little like a spaceship landed. <laughs> <laughs> but there it is. That's a feature in the iPhone 4S we call Siri. Steve Jobs, the visionary founder and leader of Apple Computer, has died at the age of 56. As I have, and I know that many of you have, we've been spending a lot of time mourning Steve's passing. For the past two weeks, I think we've all been struggling to find ways to say goodbye. This morning, I simply want to end by saying thank you, Steve. So would you like to see the next generation MacBook Pro? It is a breakthrough in display engineering. Yes, it is a retina display. In iOS 6, we have built an entire new mapping solution from the ground up. We set out to make the most accessible devices of anyone for all of our customers. Samsung must pay Apple more than a billion dollars in damages. Today, we're going to introduce iPhone 5. Our new connector is called Lightning. This is iPad Mini. Apologizing for the, uh, the mishaps with its new Maps app. Two senior executives were leaving, Scott Forstall, who ran mobile software, and John Browett, who ran retail. In fact, we're really excited about the future of the Mac, and we want a set of names that are going to carry us for at least the next 10 years. Can't innovate anymore, my ass. iOS 7 is the biggest change to iOS since the introduction of iPhone. iOS in the car. And the first one is called iPhone 5C. The second is called iPhone 5S. A7 is 64-bit. Touch ID uses a key you have with you everywhere you go. Your finger iPad, thinner, lighter, more powerful than ever before. Aaron's will take over as the head of Apple's retail stores and online stores. Hip hop mogul and headphone tycoon Dr. Dre seeming to confirm the reported deal the Beats Electronics co-founder made with Apple. Continuity, health kit, home kit extensions, metal. The language is called Swift and it totally rules. The iPhone 6 and the iPhone 6 Plus. Do you like to see it one more time? Just in case you may have blinked and missed it. Apple Watch is the most personal device we've ever created. Well, I mean, we found that the phone does indeed bend, uh, but we found that a lot of phones actually bend, and it's really just a matter of how much force is applied. It's an incredible feat of engineering. We call it the Retina 5K display. Research kit. Can you even see it? I can't even feel it. 
now there's something new. Our team invented a butterfly mechanism. Today we're announcing Apple Music. Did Apple just cave in to Taylor Swift? iPad is the clearest expression of our vision of the future of personal computing. It's called Apple Pencil. The future of television is apps. Who is Johnny, Johnny Struji and why haven't we heard of him? Well, he, he just joined uh, Tim Cook's management team uh, earlier this year and is basically running the silicon, uh, the semiconductor division. Today, we're launching Care Kit. Please keep the four inch products in our lineup. The name of the world's most advanced desktop operating system is now Mac OS. I am thrilled to show you Swift Playground. This was taken on an iPhone 7 Plus. For the first time, they display wide color gamut, that's cinema, P3 standard colors. It really comes down to one word, courage. We are so excited to show you a new product from Apple called Apple AirPods. This is the new MacBook Pro. Now, APFS is a thoroughly modern file system, 64-bit, top to bottom. And then we thought, you know, we've gone this far, let's get really nutty. So we're gonna offer it with up to 18 cores. Core ML provides high performance implementations of deep neural networks. Well, AR Kit provides fast and stable motion tracking. It is absolutely beautiful and we call it HomePod. You've said cars are an area ripe for disruption. How important is it that Apple not miss out on I, cars? I think there is a major disruption looming there. Uh, not only for self-driving cars, but also the electrification piece. We'll start moving in Apple Park later this year. But of course, such a large move, it's really more of a process. And the first big step is the opening today of the Steve, jo Steve Jobs Theater. We actually don't call them stores anymore. We call them town squares. Introducing Apple Watch Series 3, and it has cellular built in. Apple TV 4K. This is iPhone 10. Face ID is the future of how we will unlock our smartphones and protect our sensitive information. The neural engine is a state-of-the-art ultra-fast processing system. We call it air power. Apple apologizing to its consumers over that sluggish iPhone function, claiming its deliberate slowdown of older model iPhones was meant only to preserve them. The significance, please, of Apple's hiring of Google's chief of AI. We've developed a curriculum to make it easy and fun for students around the world to learn to read and write code. Heading home. You will get there in one hour. I sent a message to Cheryl. Your thermostat is set to 70 degrees and I turned on the fan, playing KQED radio. Apple Watch Series 4. Everything about it has been redesigned and re-engineered. Now you can take an ECG anytime, anywhere, right from your wrist. And because they last longer, you can keep using them. And keeping using them is the best thing for the planet. We at Apple are in full support of a comprehensive federal privacy law in the United States. This new Mac Mini is an absolute beast on the inside. Video, music, and design have all been expanded, and we're adding walks and labs to most categories. This is the new iPad Pro. The new Apple Pencil attaches magnetically. Our shortfall is uh, over 100% from iPhone, and it's primarily in greater China. Retail chief Angela Earnhardt is leaving the company this spring. Deidre O'Brien, who's been in Apple for some 30 years, is going to step in here. Apple News Plus will bring you over 3,000 magazines. With Apple Card, we have completely rethought the credit card. And with Apple Arcade, you'll get to play all of these games. Apple TV Plus. They're in a billion pockets, y'all. A billion pockets. Some keys don't register. Some keys it registers twice, so you get a double letter. We're calling it iPad OS, and I'd like to give you a first look. This is the new Mac Pro, and it's incredible. Open App Switcher. 
Four. Today, we're announcing that new framework. It's called Swift UI. Sir Johnny Ive, Apple's chief uh, design officer, will depart the company as an employee. They say that's going to happen later this, later this year. The tech giant says it's sorry for letting contractors listen to commands users gave to Siri. Apple has come under fire for how they're handling China and Hong Kong, U.S. President Donald Trump, and Russia and Crimea. Introducing Apple Watch Series 5, featuring an innovative new display that is always on. So we're really excited to offer iPhone 11 at just $6.99. That with iPhone 11 Pro, you now get up to four hours longer in your day. That was The Decade in Apple in just 10 minutes. So hit like if you do, subscribe if you haven't already, reminisce that bell gizmo so you don't miss it when the next video goes live, and then jump in the comments and let me know what was the most important things for you, for Apple, from the last 10 years. Thanks for watching, see you next video.